Shabbat Shalom everyone, that's from Law Bins, oh, hang on I'm playing in the background, L-O-R, sorry about that, L-O-R-D-I-N-S, and that's called the Lord's Prayer, of course, and that's Son of Shemites, Law Bins, and that's not Semites, but Shemites, the children of Shem, Ham, Shem and Japheth, Noah's children, that we're all descended from. And um, the original Shemites that's on my video, um, Jesus, I don't use his pagan name anymore unless I have to, to attract attention to my videos, and I always apologise, was a black man. Um, the true Israelites are black, Native American, that's Gads, and Hispanic. Just quickly, because it's 1.38am here in London, UK, near London. Just time for prayers by fire. 365 days praying the Psalms. I absolutely love the Psalms. It's a translation from Dr. Brian Simmons. It's the 24th tonight, because it's Saturday on the Hebrew calendar. Nearly time for a new moon and a new month. And it's also Hanukkah, Hallelujah. So this is a night of miracles, people. I promise you, miracles. This is from December the 22nd, but it really speaks to me. For those who are walking through the shadow of the valley of death, Psalm 23. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me, as in I. That, mean, that also means it causes repentance because you know if he chastises you, he's going to chastise the, the haters. Vengeance is mine, said the Lord. <laughs> Truly lie, my body trembles in holy awe of you, leaving me speechless. Psalm 119, 120. This is life to be with you, to hear you, to see you, living for the glory of your love. Your promise of blessing is gracious more than anyone deserves. Your words drip like oil from your being. They are alive, they are true, beautiful. I dive into the reality of your presence. You are here, you are faithful. You grasp my hands and guide me beyond the fears that shackle my soul. You set me free, I love you. My body trembles in holy awe. I find no discourse to convey what once consumed this troubled mind. Nothing else matters when I find the light of your face. I want your glory seeping into every crevice. Leave no part of me untouched by your radiant love. In you I have peace. Shalom. Shalom. In you, Yeshua, I am truly alive. Will you bring the dead to life? In you I will remain. May Yasasham in Yeshua's name. And the reason I love that so much is because I've walked through the valley of the shadow of death like many of us precious saints for quite a few years. And um, that's all through Psalms. I've always had a book of Psalms, even when I was an unbeliever, you know. Some of my family were nominal Christians, but most of them hate me now, but not my blessed daughter and my three grandchildren, four grandchildren. One of them doesn't believe, but I'm praying she will, that oldest one, of course, rebellious teenager, like we all were. And then I was chastened by Adonai, but that is a good thing. Psalm says, Blessed is the man who thou chasteneth Adonai, and teacheth him out of thy law that thou may give him rest on the day of adversity until the pit be dug for the wicked. Amen. So if you're being chastised, it's because God loves you and you're a son. If you're not being chastised, it's likely you're a bastard. <laughs> Sorry to swear, but that's in the Bible. Oh, these are my two children from Compassion, Saving Children in Jesus' Name. This is Ezekiel and Yaya. And you can see I wrote over Compassion in Jesus' Name, Joshua's Name. <laughs> because that's his name I'm saving them in all the children are his aren't they even us big children I came off to bed with white Paul the faithful comrade who's a little kid and the rock, she said to me just ask one more time I live in the house for recovering mentally ill people it's a big house made into four flats apartments you call it in America if any American brethren are watching and an office downstairs for the support worker I wanted a cat for 10 years and then the rock said to me just ask one more time and I did and five minutes later she rang me and said yeah the boss said you can have a kitten he's in my dream sometimes he's a soldier a mighty soldier that follows the line of Judah he's black like Moses but instead of one white fist one white hand and that's from the bible where Moses one of the signs was he put his hand in his bosom and drew it out and it was white leprous as white as snow but without disease but white paw has four white paws 
I used to like the Black Panther Party, um, Huey P. Newton. His book, Revolutionary Suicides, made a big impact on me. I committed more of the opposite, what he talks, reactionary suicide, when you see the horror in the world, but you feel powerless to make a difference. But now I know, live or die, I am making a difference, whether anyone knows it. And this is all by the power of your shy homoshay living inside of me. What he's done for me, he will do for you. He is not a respecter of persons, the Bible says. I better go, I can hear my cat calling me in my mind. Time to dream sleep. Maybe we'll see you in the dream world. Not an invitation to any haters. Okay, Bridget, um, I hope you'll have some fellowship. I'm feeling a little lonely, but um, some of my fam are coming tomorrow. Shabbat Shalom. Happy Hanukkah. Bye. One love.